What is up guys, it's Troy at The Full Setup here back with another video for you and today I'm going to show you a quick fix for the noisy headphone amplifier issue on the Zoom UAC232 audio interface. So basically what's going to happen is you're going to buy the UAC232, it's got 32-bit float, ultra clean F-series preamps, for £200 it's an absolute bargain, you plug it in, you start monitoring yourself and then you're hearing all this noise and hiss in your headphone am amplifier, coming out of your headphone amplifier into your headphones. And you're thinking something's got to be wrong here. Have I been sent a faulty unit? No, it's not faulty. It's just a quirk for the way that they've implemented 32-bit flow. And it only affects when you press the direct monitoring and when you turn that on. When you've got, haven't got the direct monitoring on, no issue whatsoever. And essentially kind of the reason why it does this is because you don't need to set gain on the Zoom UAC232. There's no gain knob on the front, okay? So this here, this little sliders, these little sliders, this is just digital makeup. That's all it is. It's just recording at a level at 32-bit float. It sets itself all automatically. And this is just extra. So if you were going out live and you wanted a good signal, maybe you could turn it up a little bit. But it's just volume. It's not the actual original recording going in. Now, the issue is, is that the second channel is also just doing its own thing. I've got nothing plugged into it, and it's just setting itself to a gain so if you imagine something like a focus right 2i2 or any audio interface you know say a two uh, two input one and you've got two gain knobs on the front you're always going to turn down the gain knob of the one that you're not using and that's essentially what you have to do here but there's just no gain knob to turn down so to fix it super easy just come in here and turn it down you could turn it down here as well if you wanted to just set that to zero but that's all you have to do you just turn the other input down in the UAC app. Now, I have contacted Zoom because they did actually send me this audio interface to review um, and said, I think it should be really good that when you press the direct monitoring, that it just automatically sets the level down for anything that you're not using any inputs because they are making a four mic version of this, which is going to be a bit annoying. So it's not ideal, but it kind of makes sense. You know, it's not a fault here. It's just that these preamps are running all the time. Okay, so this would almost be like if you had your preamps turned up and you don't have an input on it on another interface, it's going to add noise and it's going to add hiss. So just turn it down. Boom. No more noisy headphone amplifier. Everything just sounds good. Anyway, that's it. Quick little fix, quick little video. Make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe. I'll be back with some more videos very soon.